What's up, YouTube? I'm here with my friend Shaka. What's up, YouTube? About to go toy hunting again, as usual. We about to pop up on Toys R Us right now. So we gonna see y'all when we get there. Hopefully we find some good shit. You know what I'm saying? Looking for like two pack doors, the X23. But we gonna let y'all know what's up when we get there. Okay, you popped up, call me by surprise. You see, I never took you for the popping type. Game is 4 a.m., so please believe that. Over here in the pop section. Hmm. What is there? Is there anything new? Oh, shit. For all you anime fans, My Hero Academia, it's a Katsuki. He's a dickwad. But you know, him and the main protagonist have, you know, a great background story. And he's not the worst person. He's not a villain like everybody thought he was. He's just kind of a douchebag. Y'all go and watch this. My Hero Academia is mm -hmm. dope as fuck. They the got. Guy. I want this guy. Yeah, All Might, he's like the rawest hero that they have. And then them, this Deku. Deku's a fucking awesome kid who never even had any quirks or abilities. But All oh, Might that's the anime him. you told me about. Yeah, the one where, where everybody's got like powers and shit, but yeah, the one kid's one just kid. normal. Yeah, and then All Might is the greatest superhero they had, and he blessed them with just a strand of his hair, and now he's like battling with trying to have the overpowering All Might abilities. That's what's up. It's called One For All. Yeah, when you're done watching that, kids. Go play Qbert. <laughs> oh shit, kids don't never play Qbert, bruh. <laughs> Qbert's a classic, bruh, but even then nobody wanted to play that shit. Let's be. <laughs> yeah, it was like the most undesirable old game there was. <laughs> it's like, oh yeah, let's see. And it's like, let's be honest, I never could beat any levels anyway. I always jumped off the side. They got this big head fucking Hellraiser. Look at oh, this. Oh shit, bruh, that's dope as a fuck. Hellraiser growing up, definitely not my favorite horror movie. Yeah. But it was freaky for a little while. And look, they got these little Terminators. They yeah, just, Terminator's always there. I think Arnold Schwarzenegger's coming back for the next Terminator, actually. Even though he's like 83 by now. Yeah, he's the only person that should ever be in a Terminator. What's Terminator without Arnold Schwarzenegger? It's iRobot. For you females out there, <laughs> they got these Forces of Destiny dolls out. You know, from like the little shorts that they have on Cartoon Network. Oh, they got Princess Leia R2-D2. And they got Ray and BB-8. I mean, of course, I don't collect dolls. I'm not one of those guys that actually collects dolls, even though I'm a dude. I don't do that. I don't get down like that. But it's definitely dope for you, like your daughters or your girlfriends and whatnot. And they come with actual droids, too. So I guess that's like... With your bang for your buck. And for everybody else, this is also bang for your buck. A little whistle from Yoda. Oh, do not. <laughs> there is no time. His actual like voice commands are very limited, and he's actually not talking at all like I expect Yoda to. <laughs> but at least his eyes and his mouth and his eyebrows. I was surprised that you had to press the button like three times for him to get yeah, rid to of like one sentence. sentence. Yes. Yeah, <laughs> Once I grew up, I realized that Yoda said a lot of wise shit that he you did. could actually use in your day to day life and it'll be constructive for you. Yoda was legit. Like, like do or do not, there is, is no a try. Queen face ugh hugger from yeah, the fuck face aliens. Huggers. It's like, these are the grossest things I'm just being honest. I mean, I'm not trying to be an asshole to people who like aliens, Yeah, I knew but you were about to say. Let's stop making those movies. I knew you hated aliens, bro. Alien sucks, man. It's no predator. It's not. And then when they fused it, it just made everything hey. a shit show. Stop leaving your frozen yogurt cups and Tiger Come on, 11 spoons? Where the fuck do you even get this? I don't know, 11 yeah, spoons? Uh, Toys R Us? Toys R Us should have like an ice cream snack stand. You know what? That would make sense. They would boom like if they had. Yeah, they would make money. Something. Remember, you used to go to Foot Locker and shit like that, and they used to just have popcorn in there. You could just yeah. go in there and like go. Remember, there. Kmart used to have like the fucking what was it called? Damn, like Radio Grill. Oh yeah. Man, that shit used to go down, bro. Radio Grill used to go down in Kmart. Now Kmart suck everywhere. I'm gonna be honest with y'all. Stop giving us Red Robin commercials. We don't have one nowhere near us. Yeah. <laughs> we don't. And we don't have TGA Fridays no more either. So show stop showing Friday's us the deals that you have. Bro, I would love to have some double glazed 
fucking baby back ribs. But let's be honest, that shit's been like 10 years ago. Yeah, they took out TGI Fridays and replaced it with Ruby Tuesdays. Oh my god! Which is like, <laughs> how dare you? Who likes Tuesdays more than Fridays? I haven't seen this big figure yet. It's yeah, a, this shit's the dope. little um Imperial Hover tank driver. Mm -hmm. Wonder Woman. Jet. Jet. Yep, an invisible jet. Man, girls got all the cool toys. Yeah. And here to ruin your life is <laughs> well, Woody Minecraft from Minecraft. Was, yeah. I like it, um, Minecraft. What do you? Ooh, shoot! I never had no idea that this was coming out it's or whatever this is. Evil Superman. But it's like exclusive platinum edition Wonder Woman DC bombshell. bombshells Wonder Woman vinyl figure. It looks pretty dope. Also, I want to touch on the fact that they got this woman's head sculpt, face sculpt down like Pat. Science, yeah, she like exactly. the first ones that came out looked shitty, but this looks almost just like her. Um, she doesn't come with a. A sword or a shield, though. So that's stuff. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles is a little too hard now. And look, this is Superman and Justice, Justice One. One. Yeah, because yeah. Superman really needs a spaceship to fly around here. Exactly. <laughs> and isn't he in the bad Superman suit? Like, shouldn't he be like fucking people up? These shits are just teasing me every day. I know they keep moving, bro. They have a life. But even them. when I'm ready to actually go ahead and shell out, no pun intended, the money for these things, do I want to spend $110 on something whose box is shattered? Ooh, chill, boy. The history of the turtles, bro. Please go down. 1984. 1988. Ugh, 1992 looks gross. Oh, that's the movie one, but he doesn't look. That's like, not how it looks. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I remember that the is, next mutation. Yeah, that was the second one. 2003 relaunch. 2005 fast forward. Nine years. Nickelodeon relaunch. And the live action movies. Oh, yeah. It's the history this of is, Leonardo. They need to make a history of Raphael yeah, and Mikey. That's crazy. Why would they have a Ralph at the beginning, though? Isn't that so dumb? No, that's not Ralph. That's not That's Leonardo. The original Ninja Turtles back when they were first all created, they all had color. the same color. Yeah. Before they realized that, like, hey, we gotta like <laughs> differentiate these guys somehow. They really did that to like acquire different personalities. I realized that's how you get kids different personalities. You give them popsicles and make them choose colors. Like, yeah. <laughs> for real. Back in the day, I always knew like my cousin like he would pick like purple. So it's like why? It's clearly either red or blue. Know, there man. is no other choices. Excuse me, how you doing? Is there anything else awesome that we haven't already put out? Hmm. Let's see. Not really, bro. I know. All We're going to have to go somewhere else. Other I've been looking for this. I'm not sure if I'm gonna pull the trigger on it right now. They have a couple, so I'm gonna wait and think. But it's the Comic Con exclusive two pack doors from the Wonder Woman movie. You get Ares smiling right there alongside Wonder Woman. I want it, but I don't want it. I don't know. I want it, but I don't want it really bad. So I'm gonna think on it. It's a possibility. But for right now, I'm gonna go other places and look around. If I don't find shit, I'll come back for this, for sure. And I will not be coming back for these. Mine. Minis. Despicable Me. Crazy. Yes. Over here at GameStop, they have the GameStop exclusive fo flocked fox and socks. I know you guys had to read this growing up. This Maybe not you millennials, awesome. but if you're a 90s baby or younger, you had to read this growing up, for Fox sure. Fox socks and trucks and rocks. This is back when Dr. Seuss was like, heyday. Like, yeah, this is back in the day where everything was a tough Nowadays, the, listen, you want to know what's wrong with society? Back when we were children, we read this book and watched like Dr. Seuss stuff. Nowadays, kids don't watch this, have no idea what this is, but they know every character from this, Five Nights at Freddy. They yeah. replaced Dr. Seuss, this cute little lovable fox in socks and gloves, with an evil fucking nightmare Bonnie rabbit yeah. thing <laughs> that fucking murders people, and they act like it's okay to let your kids sit here and watch fucking little animals murder people at a pizza shop. I swear, the worst Dr. Seuss I ever got was a tongue twister. Yeah. <laughs> Tongue twister indeed. 
talk about the Tweedle Beetle battle in the Muddle Puddle. They still got the Suicide Squad, During the Joker, puddle, Batman, the and they oh, have this is flawed. a flock oh, cat yeah. dog. Oh, and it's a summer convention exclusive. Yeah. This is kind of dope. This I already dope. have it, trust me. Oh, okay. But yeah, it's definitely dope. This a must have. I still haven't even got Tommy yet. I was holding on to check for the chase. Well, Tommy is available everywhere. Y'all have a YouTube channel? Yeah. What is it? The Comet Coalition. The Comet what? Coalition. Coalition? Coalition, yeah. Okay. <laughs> That's awesome. Catch him on camera, bro. It's too there. late. His face was perfect, bro. I didn't know he was ready for the um, <laughs> he was, he for was limelight ready. here, but he yeah, someone just walked up and asked about a YouTube channel. He was, he was ready for the limelight. I don't know if he's ready for all the we things that we take, say. Remember we need, oh yeah, that's, what I, was, that's what I was thinking. That's what, he's not ready for the things we say on the yeah, channel. Yeah, that is true. I kind of wanted to take him, like, remember we had my kidnapped, <laughs> but, like, remember we need a kid for, like, movies and stuff? We, yeah, we, we did like, need a kid for a movie. He was super excited too, and it's crazy. He's like 10 and he already knows about YouTube channel. This Pokemon is dope. This Pokemon straight. This Pokemon straight. This guy straight. This, this is unacceptable. Yeah, we don't understand. <laughs> you gotta turn him backwards. Shame on you. Shame, shame, shame. I don't fucking know. I even know Nine Tails. Yeah, Nine Tails, the last of all form for Eevee. But fuck whatever this is. Fuck it. It's not a part of the original Pokemon squad. We even know you, Magic Carp. Most useless Pokemon yeah, unless definitely. it falls into a waterfall and it turns it's up here. Definitely useless though. as a fuck. <laughs> that and Diglett. Yeah. They got an Ninjago movie coming out, but look what I found. A Harry Potter one. Oh shit. Love Guardian Liviosa. <laughs> See bruh? This shit works, bro. Let me try it one more time, bro. Love Guardian Liviosa. <laughs> shit, bro. <laughs> Alright, we're over here at Walgreens now. We got nothing but this lame exclusive Joker. Got some old Marvel Legends. I don't know what the hell this is. Is that Mario though? That looks like Mario, bro. It's not. Bro. So what is this? It's not. I thought it would be something awesome. This really nice. It's a bunch of shit you don't know about. Come on. So what the hell is that then? Is that Diddy Kong? Diddy Kong? I don't know. Put that it's, down. A no, it's a no or name. the cops are going to take you away. Hmm. It's like shit going down Hurry over up. here Just on the playoff. Hurry up. This put is one down. of the reasons why down. things are going crazy. Just put it down. Come on, let's go. Ooh. I told you about that. Oh, young Come on. Batman. Kaishan, get away from there. Come Our on. kids are getting snapped now. What is this, Secret Wars? Yeah. Black All you Transformers collectors, they got Hound. They got Scourge. They got Blur. Yeah, this lady was on like 50 hours away from her kids. Her kids she's mad and she's mad because they're, they're over here playing on toys. But <laughs> bitch, you need to look after your kids. Don't have kids if you're not going to take care of them. And at least he was a good father. He's saying Goldberg. Yeah, that's what I always said when I was a little. And you know, Goldberg. You know what's funny about all that? It's like, bitch, you just made a scene and you're the one not watching your kids. <laughs> yeah. like, you're about to get locked up. <laughs> you're the one not taking care of your babies. That's right. You're going to make a scene as soon as you find them. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, there you are. Not like I didn't tell you to go fucking find something to do while I did other stuff across the store. You could have got kidnapped. Let's see. Design a vital storm trooper. Those are kind of dope. They're dope, but I just don't got the time and the patience to color something with a marker. Yeah. It's like, obviously, you gotta be an artist to do this shit. Well, there's not shit over here at this Walgreens, so we're gonna dip, we're go gonna somewhere try. else. These yeah, for hippies, we're gonna dip and go <laughs> somewhere else. Hopefully, we find something somewhere today. But yeah. We'll catch y'all when we get there. Alright, so I drove to the Target that's farthest away from me in my city in hopes to find the Thor Ragnarok Marvel Legends. And all I found was this. 
Ooh. Great, thanks a lot. Also drove over here to find the Justice League multiverse figures. And to my surprise, all they had was this. Just Wonder Woman in every way that you great. can get it. Great, fucking great. Thanks a lot, you fucking dumbass target. You never have what I need. They have these three bears though. And hey, they have this. We're not gonna buy the newest Marvel Legends, but we're gonna stock up on fucking toy bears and stack them around Groot's. Look, they have the Justice League shit show edition with the exclusive Lex Luthor. That shit is so fucking weak, man. Yeah. They haven't even sold like their half faces. of their Batman vs Superman toys yet. And Justice League is about to come out in a couple months. Tighten up, Target. Tighten up, indeed. This is the best thing they got is this raw ass fucking. Yeah, I would like to have that display in my room. They have Rita Repulsa. This is actually like the hardest to find out of the Power Ranger toys that nobody wants. <laughs> so I guess it doesn't make it too rare, but it's rarer than all the other peg warmlies. It's not even that it's rare, it's just nobody's looking for it. <laughs> it's like Power Ranger Ninja Steel. Nobody cared about it. What kind of Megazord is that? It's the Ninja Megazord. It's weak, because look, yeah. they're supposed to put a whole Power Ranger right there. <laughs> Come on, man. <laughs> Why is a Power Ranger the size of a Megazord? Fucking Power Ranger sticking out of his whole fucking chest torso. Yeah. Basically. I still got plenty of this guy. Playing the long game with you, buddy. You're $60 now, but I guarantee you I'll take you home for $13.98 in a couple months. All I see over here is bullshit that they've been having on clearance, Star Wars clearance. Mm -hmm. But sitting in the midst of everything else, da, da, we have da. my first official sighting of Justice League merchandise. Mm. And what is this? Batman, Superman, and Stephen Wolf. Yeah, Stephen Wolf looks like a fucking beast. Like, I'm sorry. I know you guys are going to hate me for this, <laughs> but I don't know, man. I'm not feeling the villains that they've been using for these DC movies. Like, I know you guys probably like the Aries, and you guys like Stephen Wolf. I thought he was. I thought he was Aries. I know you guys like Aries, and I know you guys like Stephen Wolf, but I don't. These aren't classic DC villains. The classic DC villains I grew up with, like Brainiac and things like that. These are like some new god type bullshits. And I'm sorry, this is not the direction that I want the DCEU to go in. But it clearly is. There's nothing I can do about it. I mean, you could press a button and his fucking axe glows. But what the fuck is the big difference between him and Ares? They're it's basically the same, the same person. person. And it's probably going to be a weak ass battle at the end. Just like with Doomsday and just like with Ares at the end of Wonder Woman. I'm sorry DC. I love you DC. Batman you're like my favorite superhero. Maybe besides Spider-Man. But your movies aren't doing it for me really. They act like Wonder Woman was a great move in the right direction. It really wasn't. I'm sorry. <laughs> Major look. Please be better, Justice League. Please be good. I've got my fingers crossed. I want this movie to be good. I really, really do. And I don't mean to hate, but this right here... It's just... This and Parademons, I'm not excited about it. I'm sorry. I'm just not. But it's nice to see this toy. I'm sure I'll buy a bunch of like Justice League merchandise eventually. But I won't be buying this. <laughs> Look what I finally found after a long time of searching. Oh, that's I found the Darth Vader with TIE Fighter Deluxe Pop. Um, I'm sorry, I'm not trying to be like an asshole, but was this thing not bigger? Like, I could have sworn this is like the size of a big six inch pop rod, but yet right here next to a wacky wobbler, they're like the same size. Mm -hmm. Everyone's been making it look like it's humongous. This thing is pretty small. And actually really small, like if you want to like... It's the size of a regular pop. It's almost the size of a regular pop, honestly. I'm going to do a size comparison with a regular pop. This thing's not that big at all. Not for 30 bucks. I'm not paying for 30 bucks for that. 
stuff in there. This is a Darth Vader with TIE Fighter next to a normal size pop. You see how they're like exactly the same size, yet they want us to pay $27.99 for that. Yeah, and $8.99 for this, like come on man. Maybe $20 bucks I could see, or $15. Not $30. Bucks. This is not the pop that I was looking for. This, oh my god, I can't believe it's that small. Alright, YouTube. Had a whole different target. Nothing at all. A bunch of pointless legends. Well, they got Kitty. I don't know. I feel like I haven't seen Kitty before. I've seen her a million bazillion times. And no Justice League multiverse. No Thor Ragnarok wave. I'm not getting lucky at this, you guys. They do have Misty Knight. As always. <laughs> the number one peg warm of the century. They got some of this on. Daryl Dixon on clearance here. Call you walking deadheads. I can't do it. I'm about to throw up. Cannot watch Walking Dead. Oh, look what they have here. They got a new Lego set. New Aquaman. Aquaman um, Justice League Lego set. Um, I don't know. It seems kind of like a boring Lego set for to me because all you do is build these little temple walls I guess so I think I'll be passing on that but this shit is boss as fuck yeah this shit's pretty awesome Pink that's Arctic a boss Royce. ass fucking Lego car yeah bro. look at this shit's fucking Rolls Royce boss that that's just dope man definitely dope shoot out of it why would battle ring shoot out of a penguin car tomorrow he's throwing it oh, oh, look, look, oh. Penguin cooler. he does got a penguin glider that comes out the back that's pretty so dope. That's dope. Good job, Lego. Yeah, Lego. You're doing great things here. You're doing great things. Over here to the Star Wars section. We have a big crock load of nothing. Nothingness. Come on, stories. Y'all gotta start doing better. I can't be out here toy hunting for no reason. I swear I'm about to throw up. Shaka's about to throw up from all the toy hunting today <laughs> with no good finds. It's the same shit everywhere we go at, man. Same shit everywhere. Like, y'all need to tighten up, man. Do I need to get technical with these motherfuckers and start pulling out the codes so they can lie and be like they don't got shit in the back? Because I will. Mm -hmm. I will do that. Yeah, and I will secretly rec Yeah, I've done it thousands of times. You can ask Shaka, he's always there. And I actually get irate <laughs> with these people and yes. argue with these people. Yes, I will pull out these codes. I almost had a box one of these. Man. Yeah. Really gonna have to start strong arming these motherfuckers out the goddamn the Marvel Legends, bruh. Shit's getting oh, hectic. Chill, boy. They should have got a Riddler racer. A Riddler racer is nothing compared to the Double Double. <laughs> It's not as good as the penguin car. Oh yeah, of course it's not. Oh shit. <clears throat> and the Joker fucking caddy. The Joker clearly got hungry. Damn man, shit sucks. They don't got any more like the Justice League Lego sets and I don't know man, don't get me wrong, I want a Aquaman minifigure and all that shit, but that's the set is just a boring just get build. A creator RV fucking Lego with a fucking bear. One thing I don't understand about Legos is why make it so hard? Wait, it's three and one, bro. You can either make this house, Ooh, you can make this RV, or you can make this boat. Oh, shit, now, that's bro, dope. that is fine. That makes sense. Yeah, that is. I would make the house fun, probably, because the RV is actually bigger than the house, and I never understood things like that. Cause I kind of wanted to make my own like little. I was gonna get a big table and make my own like small Lego city. Cause you know I got like a Lego restaurant and stuff. It's a three and one too. These three and ones are kind of dope. See that See, apartment building right there. Apartment, could, that yeah. will work out in my Lego city. See that's what I'm saying. Or get even this, this little cafe. Yeah, this shit is dope. Make a whole Lego city. Yeah, I want the whole Lego city, well, we bro. Have, like an Avengers Tower somewhere. To yeah, definitely gonna have to. superhero shit in there, like boss mode. Look, they got a whole Lego city right there. Yeah, but those police stations look whack, bro. Oh. 
Bro, I gotta show you some of the Lego cities people build, like customize it, and it's just super crazy. All right, so this brings an end to this little toy hunting video. Didn't find anything worthwhile, even though all you guys out there are finding all the DC Multiverse Justice League figures and all the cool Thor Ragnarok Marvel Legends. I couldn't find shit. Shaka almost threw up from <laughs> lack of finding anything cool. Yes. And seeing the same things for the last month and a half at my stores. <laughs> um, I did, however, pick some things up. Anyway, I picked up Anthony Mackie here from 8 Mile. <laughs> Except he has wings. I don't know why. But he was on clearance for $5.98. He doesn't come with Eminem. He doesn't come with a mic. <laughs> but Clarence's parents did have a real nice marriage, so I decided to pick him up for six bucks. And I've been saying I'm gonna step into this field for a while now, but I never have. And I'm not gonna count this as officially stepping into this world, but or you know, going down this wormhole, whatever people like to call it. But I picked this guy up, Red Yoshi my first Nintendo figure pickup, but he was only a dollar. So I was like, what the hell? I'm not even gonna keep him in box. I'm gonna take him out of the box because his packaging is ripped up anyway. But for one fucking dollar, I figured why not? You might as well just get him, call it a fucking day. I didn't want to leave with absolutely nothing. So that's what I got. I almost crashed my car talking to you guys just now. But be sure to like this video. Be sure to subscribe. Stay tuned for more toy hunts. I'm trying to get Shaka to get his shit together and start this anime channel, but he's taking forever. So what do you have to say about that, bro? Why are you taking so long to get that? I got cameras right here. There's no excuses, bro. No reason, bro. I'm about to shoot that uh, anime fucking... We can start the shit this weekend, man. All right, brother. Shit, I guess that'll be the new project, man. Y'all stay tuned for that shit. So stay tuned for that. Stay tuned for more videos from this channel. Hopefully the toy hunt, next toy hunt will be better and I'll find something worthwhile. But I still had to pick up a few things. But like I already said, be sure to like, be sure to subscribe. And as always, you have a good day, YouTube.